Here we have a market and we're told that there's an excise tax, which is the distance between P prime and P3 or P1 and P3. So what you want to do is recognize that uh, the distance here to here would be the tax. Uh, also the distance between here and here. So we're going to just draw like a line right here. This becomes S plus tax. And then uh, our dead weight loss is going to be the loss in consumer and producer surplus. So now we're only going to produce and consume to here. So we're going to lose this part of the consumer surplus. And then we're going to lose this part of the producer surplus. And that is now the uh, dead weight loss. Okay, that's in yellow. And then the government is putting a tax on this market, so that means that whatever this quantity is will be taxed, and it'll be taxed at a rate of P prime to P3. So the areas of K and L would both be the tax revenue for the government. So there's your, there's how to think about this. K and L would be the tax revenue. I and uh, Y would be the dead weight loss. And then all the way down here, this would be the producer surplus. So the M would be producer surplus and J would be consumer surplus.